Let's talk about skunk pet rescue. Now what we're talking about is a domestically bred skunk because in most states uh, skunks are considered wildlife whether they're domestically bred or a wild creature. And so you never ever try to uh, rescue a wild skunk on your own. Um, the main reason is because they can harbor rabies which is fatal to humans. And so check with your local wildlife agency in the first place uh, to see if owning a pet skunk is actually even legal. Usually you would have to have a, a license or a permit to do that anyway. So if you're talking about adopting one, um, if it is illegal, um, then basically you harbor them like you do um, a, a, a small type of mammal um, as far as housing is concerned and, and wire caging with bedding in the bottom. They're actually pretty smart uh, small mammals. Uh, pet skunks are typically descented uh, when they're young, like four to six weeks of age. Otherwise, no one can get near them as they get older. Um, when they're really, really small babies, uh, generally they're weaned after about two months of age. They reach sexual maturity about a year of age. And so if it is a domestically bred skunk, uh, you need to find a veterinarian who's familiar with exotic species, especially skunks. Um, and they need to be spayed and neutered as well. And you can talk to them about vaccination and nutritional care um, and things of that nature.